Hey guys, Mr. Whack 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 here, and today we're gonna be opening four of these hockey surprise packs from Dollarama. And let's see what we could get. Okay, so we're gonna open the first pack first and let's see what, what's gonna be inside. Okay, so we got uh, six trading cards on this pack. And then we got uh, the hottest uh, cards on ice from 1991-92 Series 2. And then also, we also got um, original six franchise pack and uh, has four cards. Then also we got uh, one superstar uh yeah one superstar pack and it has four cards inside okay so let's see what we get what we can get in this okay so one moment these are packs are very hard to open. Okay, so we got an artifacts of Mark Giordano, and then we got a uh, score 91 of Alan Kerr, and then we got a Parkhurst of Keith Jones, and then a SBA base card of Oscar Clefbaum. Let me just put these cards aside and let's open the next pack of the mystery pack. Okay, so we got, what is this? Which brand is this? Uh, okay, so I don't even know. So yeah, we got uh, Gary Roberts, um, Colton Orr, and we also got hmm, Rob Ramage and Thomas Cabral. Sorry guys if I'm pronouncing them wrong. I'm trying my best, but yeah. Some of these names are hard to pronounce for me. But yeah, okay, now let's open the six trading cards. Let's see what's inside. Okay, so we got uh, MVP of Brady Kachuk, uh, Rasmus Dahlin, base card, Kevin Deneen, Andre Lomakin, Michael Reeson, and Oliver Ekman Larson, base card. Okay, so in this, this, the first mystery pack, we got all the three or four whichever pack so let's open the sealed pack of the series two of 1991 and 1992 haven't opened these packs before so don't know what to expect here but hopefully you get something good okay so steve thomas uh, i don't know how to pronounce it. i think that's rob De, De, Mayo, De Mayo, Jeff Smith, Rob Ray, David Maley, Tony Horacek, uh, Pat McLeod, Alan May, Charlie Huddy, Ron Sutter, Michael Petit, uh, Craig Barub, Colin Patterson, Rob Brown, Dominic Hasek, 
And that was it. Uh, what's this? Oh, it's just a discount card, I think. Probably. Okay, so that was the first one. Not sure if these cards were good or not, but I mean, it's pretty good for the price for the first one. Okay. On to the next pack. The second one we got here. Hopefully, we get something better. Oh, probably not, but see what else we can get in this one. Okay, so we got the six trading cards. And we got a 20-point mini snap card holder. Then the four goalie cards and thousands of point club cards. Okay. Let's let's do the thousand point one first. I'm just gonna cut here. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, let's see. This is good to buy, and at the end I will say I will my opinion this is good to buy or not but yeah oh my gosh i'm gonna break the corners on these some of these packs are easy to open and some of these are not but yeah okay oats i don't know the first name adam oats uh, bill mcdougall Trevor Daly and Ted Krygear. Okay, and then next, I think I should open the the goalie pack. Gonna open these behind me so behind the camera so it's easier okay so we got a uh, uh, spx uh rick dip d pietro and then we got uh between the pipes great of the games tony esposito then we got uh bowman of mike vernon and we also got uh, b between the pipes of Darren McChesney. Okay, I'm not sure about this, about the Rick DiPietro SPX card. This is valuable, but I'll put the prices up on how much they're worth online. I mean, yeah, how much they're worth online. And I'm gonna put it, uh, I'm edit it into the video and we'll see how much all these cards are worth. Okay, next we go for the six trading cards. Cunning is the best in the world. Totally. Okay. We got a uh, Matt Culvert base card. Uh, we got Nate Smith. Nate. Oh my gosh. Nate Smith uh, base card. And then uh, Mitch Marner SBA Authentic base card and we also got uh, Brad May for pro set it's a rookie card and then uh, Peter Popovich card sorry it's hard for me to read because of the shininess and I'm actually reading it through a camera so yeah and then uh, Chet Picard Okay, that's, uh, that's, that's already two mystery packs, so yeah, and then, uh, no young guns, I don't think I'm expecting for any of them, because it's only two dollars, but I don't know, because once I opened one of these, like, a long time ago, but it's a different one, not th these kinds, and I got, like, a guest card worth, like, twenty dollars on there, but yeah, that's pretty cool, so yeah, we got, um, 
four top loaders. We also got uh, six trading cards again. Then we got Can Can Canadian team franchise pack, with four Canadian players, and then the superstar pack. Okay, I'm gonna go with the superstar pack first. Let's see if there's any special cards in here. Okay, so Cal Palmieri, uh, Al Secord, Scott Niedermeyer, Brent Burns, and yeah, that was that was for that one. Let's open the Canadian one. Okay, so we got Yespiri Kotkaniemi. <laughs> got uh, I don't know how to say that don't want to pronounce it too incorrectly but yeah that's his name right there and then so I've got uh, Bobby Smith and Andrew Shaw base card okay so the next one is four hockey packs I mean the four, the six, uh, six official trading cards. That, yeah, six cards. And uh, my plan with these cards is I'm probably gonna, probably gonna uh, call that. Um, give these away. Like the stuff here for free. Um, I'll make the comments. Uh, I'll make you guys able to comment, and I'll select the one winner. Whoever comments, uh, like anything, comment whatever you want. How how'd I do? And I will you'll have a chance to um be able to win some of these cards. I know these cards are not the best, but it's the best I can give for now. Okay. Jaden Swartz. Um Brian Trottier. Uh John Bice. Thomas Forslund, Cody Franson, and Kevin Hayes. Okay. Sorry guys if this video is too long. Uh, I got four packs. Let me know if I should do another one of these. But yeah. Okay, for the fourth pack. Let's see if we can get some good stuff. Oh yeah, I forgot to show you guys the back. But uh, in each pack, we have a chance of getting a superstar pack, goalie pack, hall of famer pack, uh, memor memorabilia edition, rookie, pa rookie pack, and the 70s and 90s. The ones I haven't got yet was probably the hall of famer, the rookie pack, the memorabilia edition, and the 80s, 70s and 80s. Probably got one of those, probably just forgot. Oops, my credit card. Yeah, guys, I just got this today. It's uh, my... It's a Chris Tierney PSA 9. Yeah, it's a pretty cool card because it's Pop 1. But not the best name, but still a pretty cool card. Okay, so we got uh, the six uh, official trading cards. We got another pack of these. Not 1991-92 Series 2 packs from uh, Pro Set. And then we got the original six franchise pack and then the four cards. Let's so go with the four cards first. I'm just gonna move these aside so they're not in the way. But yeah. Okay. Hopefully we have we have a tiny bit of luck, but yeah. Okay, so we got, um, let me just flip this over. We got a OPG Platinum of Ryan Ellis. We got, uh, what's the first name? Tommy Salo. Yeah. We got a Tommy Salo goalie card. And then we also got, uh, Jim Kite, score 91. 
And we also got, and then lastly, we also got Br Brandon Morrow. On to the next pack. Gonna be opening the original six franchise pack next. Okay, so we got Lanny McDonald's it's a card, cool name, because, yeah, the guy who helped the Flames win the cup. Uh, how do I say his name? Eric Fishod. I'm not sure if I'm saying that right, but please forgive me if I'm saying these names wrong, because, honestly, I do not know any of these guys. Uh, Brad Marsh. And... The name Carlo Holy, how do I say that? I'm not gonna say that, but here's the name. I'm trying to say, I'm trying to learn these names, but I don't know. For me, they're pretty hard to read, so I'm reading them through a camera. But enough, enough excuses. Ex oh my gosh, my English was happening. Enough excuses, but yeah, I'm gonna try to practice these names and then, yeah. Then we got this pack. I'm gonna leave the the series series two pack as last one, but here's the last like repackage pack. Sorry if my scissor cutting is very weird. I'm trying my best, so please forgive me. Okay, so. We got a Tory Krug base card. We got a Mike Riley base card. And then, what is this card? Uh, we got uh, Eric Desjardins, uh, Top Stadium Club. Hopefully, I said that uh, correctly. And the back of the card. I don't know, it looks pretty cool. I mean, old cards are very way different than new cards because the new cards nowadays are like very shiny i try to make it shiny but i mean the shiny looks for me it looks better but uh write down in the comments on your opinion on these cards if you like them shiny or like the old cards where I feel like cardboard i mean they all feel like cardboard but yeah uh, uh so we got ken hamond we also got uh Yuri Otter's uh, Heroes and Prospects of Ryan O'Mara, O'Mara or O'Mara, and then we got, uh, oh, how did I say this, Mikhail, okay, I'm, I'm not going to say this, but here's the name, I'm really bad at pronouncing these names, so sorry guys. But, yeah, that's just how it's going to be for now. Hopefully, when I get more experience on these, I'm going to be able to pronounce these names properly. But, yeah. Then, the last pack of the video is going to be this Pro Set, the hottest cards, uh, Pro Set, the hottest cards on ice of 1991-92 Series 2. Yeah. Okay, Brent Ashton, Bob McGill, Jeff Smith, uh, Mikhail or Michael Anderson, Scott Melan Melanby, uh, Sylvan Turgeon, uh, Daryl. Shannon, Alan Coat. Uh, not sure if I'm saying that right, but yeah. Mike McNeil, Ron Sutter, Alex. Uh, I don't know how to say that, guys. But here's the name. I don't know. It sounds pretty, uh, pretty, uh, 
pretty unique, but I don't know how to say this. I don't want to say, I don't want to disrespect by saying it like very awfully wrong, but yeah. Kevin Deneen. What's this? Oh, it's a cartoon. I think this is the cartoon of an of the arena or something. Or probably something else. I'm not even sure. And then uh, Dave Brown. Mike Ho. Ho uh, uh, it's probably uh, uh, whatever. Whatever. Can't say it properly. Uh, but yeah. And then we got this 10% thing off. Oh, wait. It opens up. I didn't even know. But yeah. Rat Rink Fan Club. <laughs> okay, guys, that's it for today. Uh, so, uh, all the names are pronounced. All the names I pro probably pronounced wrong. Probably all of them. Uh, please correct me in the comments. And sorry if it kind of offended you. But yeah, I'm trying my best to say these names. Also, uh, if you guys also want to try these packs out, they're from Dollarama. They basically look like this. And yeah, they're only two dollars each pretty good price and the whole point of this video is uh is it worth it i would say for me uh for a collector if you want to if you want to buy cards just for trading like small trades or like keeping collection that'd be good but if you want if you want to have like the good high-end cards like the good young guns i would i would always recommend the series one and two ones or like just buy the ones you like online because it's better just to buy the ones you want you like it's just spending a ton on packs just for just looking for a card that you that you want and then you don't even open it but yeah that's for that's it for today sorry for the long video but yeah thank you guys peace all right guys also forgot to say uh i'll put the page my patreon i just made one yesterday i'll put it in the links in the description also put it in my channel description if you guys want to be able to win a chance to win young guns, like free young guns or any cards, like for example this card, I could like give this to you for free if you become a Patreon. It's up to you if you want. Uh, yeah, I'll also shout you out and all those stuff basically. Yeah, chance every month to win a young gun or three dollars or five dollars, up to you which one you wanna you wanna choose. You don't have to, but yeah, but whoever. Whoever, I'll choose like one, one person in the comments, and I'll personally send them uh, a random card that I opened, or probably multiple cards that I opened, cause yeah, and for free, basically I'll even pay for shipping and stuff. But yeah, I'll choose a random person in the comments. So please comment, like and subscribe if you want. It's up to you. It's your choice if you want. I mean. It would really support it would really support me if you guys did. But yeah, it's up to you. Thanks guys and